The European Commission adopted an act to support the production of military ammunition to help Ukraine. The point is for us to, um, to make sure that we can increase the capacity of production of um, this ammunition. About half a billion euros will be allocated to encourage European Union manufacturers to increase production of artillery shells and other military ammunition for Ukraine. I'm confident that uh, we, we could be able to upscale uh, our industrial base to be able to produce uh, at least uh, uh, one million uh, ammunition uh, uh, in Europe uh, um, for Ukraine. The European Union has common challenges because an aggressive neighbor is the only one. We cannot be naive. This is not a fact. And it's our responsibility uh, uh, to make sure that we do whatever uh, we can to continue to protect also together, together our uh, fellow citizens and then adapt ourselves to these new geopolitical uh, realities. This is exactly what we are doing today. European officials do not disclose the date when the first ammunition produced under this act will arrive in Ukraine, but they promise that they will do it as soon as possible. This is very sensitive information, and of course uh, we have to be very careful to keep this information for us. What I could tell you is that, of course, it's not only 155, it is uh, uh, a lot of uh, other ammunition. I mentioned 152, I mentioned 120, I mentioned 122. I mentioned uh, missiles, uh, anti-tanks, uh, um, uh, anti-aircraft, and this is all category, of course, of, uh, of ammunition. Reported by Vitaly Sizov, UATV News.